Hello everyone, it's our last chapter. It's already our chapter 20 and it's our last chapter of verse 1. So let's see our last chapter vocabulary which is about 학교, school and 유학, study abroad and then 취직, 준비, prepare for, get a job. So this one is our last part of Vocabulary. Let's see together. So first one, let's see here the picture here. So you see schools here. So let's see about school. First one, 학교. We know 학교, right? School. 학교, school. Okay, school. And then you see here, mm, they go to the school, right? But then there is 입학 here. 입학 and here. Chuk. Chuk is abbreviation with congratulation. Mm, congratulation is chuk, chukha, chuk, and then hakyue ipakada. So you see here, ipak is to enter. Mm, enter. So to enter school. Maybe they are like graduate school and enter a new school. Mm. So maybe graduate elementary school and go to the middle school is 입학하다. So going to a new school is 입학하다. 입학하다. So let's see the first one here. 초등학교. So there are three parts of 학교s here. So first one, 초등학교. 초등학교. So our first school is Elementary. So elementary is 초등학교. 초등학교 elementary school. 초등학교. Then what about here? You see middle school. 중학교. 중 means middle. So 중학교 middle school. Middle school. 중학교. Then last one here. 고등학교. 고등학교 is high school. Go means high, so 고등학교 is high school. So three schools here, 초등학교, 중학교, 고등학교. So maybe you can say 초등학교에 입학하다. Or 중학교에 입학하다. Or 고등학교에 입학하다. So you can say I enter elementary school. I enter middle school, I enter high school. So you can say 초등학교에 입학하다, 중학교에 입학하다, 고등학교에 입학하다. Okay, then here you see another university, another school here. So it's 대학교. 대 means big in Korea. 대 is big. So big school means uh, college. University, so in Korean, 대학교, you say college is 대학교, 대학교. And then, if you want to say about the name of 대학교, it comes in front of 대학교. So maybe, 등등 대학교, 서울 대학교. You can say the name before 대학교, okay? Then now here, so you saw 입학하다, right? Enter the school. Then now, after 대학교, you graduate. 학교를 졸업하다. 졸업 is graduate. 하다, we know, 하다 verb. 학교를, so graduate the school. Mm, I graduated school. Okay. Also, this one, you can say 초등학교를 졸업하다. 중학교를 졸업하다. 고등학교를 졸업하다, which you can say, I graduated elementary school, I graduated middle school, I graduated high school, I graduated college. So you can say like this. Mm -hmm. And now you see here, after you have graduated university, college, then now what is she doing? She is, let's talk about, you have. Mm, so, yuhag is study abroad. Study abroad. 
And in order to study abroad, you have to prepare 준비하다. So, 유학을 아, studying abroad, 준비하다, prepare, preparing, study abroad, 유학을 준비하다. And then, so she is preparing, having an interview and studying. And now, he goes, 가다, 유학을 가다 means he went to study abroad or go to study abroad. 가다, 가다, go, okay. And then, 유학하다 is just study abroad. Mm, I'm doing study abroad. I am studying abroad. So in Korea, you'll say 하다 verb and 유학. So I'm doing this. I am studying abroad. You'll say 유학하다, 유학하다. Okay. Then do you guys remember? 학생, right? 학생 is student. Right, 학생. So maybe, 초등학교 학생, elementary school student, 중학교 학생, middle school student, 대학교 학생. You say 대학생. Mm -hmm. 대학생. This one is I'm student of college, college student. And also, if you want to say I'm a high school student, then you'll say just 고등학생. So put them together. 학생 plus 대학교, 학생 plus 고등학교. Then this means college student and high school student. Also same for middle school student, you'll say uh -huh. 중학생, just say 중학생. Then what about 초등학교 학생, elementary school student? You'll say 초등학생. Then last one, let's see here. Maybe if you go abroad, study abroad, then you are a abroad student, right? Then you'll say just 유학생. If you introduce yourself as 유학생, that means that I'm studying abroad, I'm a student that I study abroad. 유학생. Okay. And here, now you see here, after finishing studying abroad, then now you have to prepare for a job. To get a job, you have to prepare it. Mm, there is a time that you have to put resume and you have to prepare for get a job. So first one, let's see. She, 빌리다 borrows, 책을, a book. So to borrow a book, you say 책을 빌리다, borrow a book, borrow a book. And now second one, she, 공부하다, study. Okay, what does she study? 외국어를 공부하다. Okay, we know 한국어, right? 한국어를 공부하다. We, right? You guys are studying Korean. 한국어를 공부하다. But then 외국어 is foreign language. So 국어 is a language, and 외 외국어 is other foreign language. Mm, not your mother tongue language. Other than your mother tongue language, first language, it's a 외국어, foreign language. 외국어를 공부하다. Okay. And third one, she studies 공부하다. Which one? Computer. Mm. So these days, we have to study about computer, right? You have to fill out the documents and make some PowerPoints. Now you have to study 공부하다, computer. Computer. Okay. So, and last, she did. She did get a job. 취직하다. Got a job. Means 취직하다. 취직하다. So, she 취직하다 했어요. Mm -hmm. Then last one, she 따다. 따다 is to get. Mm, get or earn. 운전면허증을 Unzan is drive, drive, and Myeonhotzung is license. So, driver's license is Unzan Myeonhotzung. So, Tada, she have earned her 
운전, 면허, the driver's license. So she has the car now. 음, 운전 면허증을 따다, earned, 따다. Okay. So let's practice our vocabulary here. So first one, let's match them together with the verb. 학교에 something something, 유학을 something, and 운전면허증을 something something. Okay, let's see. 학교에 is school, right? 학교에 at school. So what do you do with the school? 따다, earn, 입학하다, enter, 준비하다, prepare. So school. Do you earn the school? Or do you enter the school? Or do you prepare the school? Hmm. So you'll say enter the school, right? So you'll say 학교에 입학하다. 학교에 입학해요. 학교에 입학하다. Second one, 유학, study abroad. 유학을, what do you do with study abroad? 따다, earn it. Or 준비하다, prepare. Mm -hmm. 유학을 준비하다, prepare. Prepare study abroad. Okay. 운전면허증을, what do you do with driver's license? You have to earn it. 따다, 운전면허증을 따다, 따요. Okay. So second one here. Let's see our first picture. What is she doing? She has the hat. And she has the, this one, which is your graduate sheet. Mm, so the form and graduate hat. So what do you say? Graduate. Mm -hmm. 졸업하다. 졸업하다. Graduate. 졸업하다. And then second one. Oh, here. 회사. 회사. 회사 is a company. So maybe he got a job, right? So he's going to his company. So how should we say to get a job? 취직하다, got a job. 취직하다, 취직해요, 취직하다. Third one, oh, here, 입학축. So he is entering a new school, right? So how should we say? 학교에 입학하다, okay, 입학 here. 입학하다. Oh, congratulations coming here, entering the school. So, 학교에 입학하다. Hmm. So, we have learned about study, school, and also study abroad, and getting a job. So, please review these vocabularies and come back. 당신을 위한 한국어 마스터, 마스터 토픽.